So you want to be a general manager for the greatest sports entertainment company in the world. I've been in this industry my whole life, seen many come and go. And now here you are taking your first step into the mix. Tell me, what are you looking for? Fame, glory, prestige? What kind of a general manager will you become? Have you thought about that? Will you be a fair and balanced overseer? Or maybe you'll rule your roster with an iron fist. Either way, one thing you need to do is make impact. I didn't start my career in the WWE as a general manager like you're about to. I had to earn my spot through years and years of dedication to this business. But you, you still have so much to prove. You would not have been given this opportunity if we didn't see your potential. You must understand, 200 plus days a year, we're on the road to entertain the WWE Universe. Some careers are long, others aren't quite as lucky. But if you respect our business, if you love our business, then even you could become a legend one day. So are you ready? It's time to prove you deserve this chance. An opportunity that you can't let slip through your fingers. You must earn it. You must pay your dues. So I have to ask again, what kind of general manager will you become? Let's see if you have what it takes to be my GM. Who am I going to be? Am I going to be Adam Pierce? Am I going to be Sonia Deville? Or am I going to be William Regal? Or what about I'm, I'm, or the McMahons? Or a custom superstar? Oh yeah. I know exactly who I'm going to use. That's the guy right there. Badlands Chugs. Smackdown Raw. NXT or NXT UK Smackdown Let's go up against William Regal and Raw It's gotta be as difficult as possible Each GM will start with a budget of two million seven thousand and five hundred or uh, fifty. You know what? Two two mil. I get two mil. GMs will take turns drafting one another, one after the other, starting with player one. There will be eight rounds of drafting. After the 8th round of drafting, drafting becomes optional. GMs can opt out or draft until they are out of cash. Okay, GMs can press the R3 button to get recommendations on who to draft. You also can press the square button to get more information about a superstar. Awaiting Smackdown's top choice. Hmm. Who is gonna be my top choice? To be honest, I think it's uh, pretty obvious who my top choice is gonna be. Uh, it has to be Edge. It has to be Edge. Who else is it gonna be? Then we're taking Roman Reigns. We're going all the way in. I do not care about the budget. Oh, he took, he took John Cena. Oh, I'm taking Seth Rollins. You swear to God, I can take AJ Styles and kill you. Roderick Strong. The Messiah of the Backbreaker on a new night. I can't deny his passion. Good guy to have on your side. AJ Styles, bro. SmackDown about to make their fifth selection. Okay, who am I gonna? I need like a. Like some tag teams here. Let's get Kofi Kingston Kofi and Xavier Woods and, and Big E on the Oh, they took Big E already. 
This guy is right on the cusp of a championship. Do they even have that they don't have him, do they? No, okay, let me take Buddy Murphy then. Murphy! A new world for Murphy to conquer. The GM sees him as a future champion. Uh let's take Fucking, I don't know. We are, I need, I need female superstar. Uh, let's take Oscar. She's got all the tools necessary to succeed. Let's take with Liv Morgan. The GM looking to live dangerously. She's going to be a big player here very soon. And let's take uh, I'm only drafting three more people. Let's go with Fuck it, let's go with uh, Kevin, Kevin Owens. Owens. Kevin Owens, a stunning pick for SmackDown. He's all fists, feet, uh, and fury. What a Alexa great Bliss. pick. Who is about to join the Raw roster? T-Bar. A powerful T-Bar. Ready to make his mark on a new night. Man who it's reinvents himself be... by the day. Big things are coming. Fuck it, Sami Zayn. He deserves it after that banger he had with Johnny Knoxville. That is the roster of Badlands Chugs of SmackDown. Tell me that's not a good roster right there. You're smoking crack if you don't believe me. Look at my roster and look at his. I'm missing two people but I don't give a fuck. Houston, Texas week one. Tonight is the night, the debut show. We have high hopes for you. I was born for this. Good, I'm expecting big things of SmackDown this season. Making an amazing show. All right, who will be our universal champion? Edge, it's gonna be Edge. I was the first person drafted. And the women's champion, I only have four women. Jesus. Uh, I don't even know. I'm just gonna close my eyes and draft a random one. Alright, it's Rhea Ripley. School gymnasium? What is this? Sign legends? Goldberg, Stone Cold, The Undertaker, Ultimate Warrior, Macho Man, Roddy Piper, Kevin Nash, Razor Ramon, Bret Hart, Batista, X-Pac, Ted DiBiase, China, Jerry the King, Lawler, Mr. Big Man, Mickey James, The Big Boss Man, and JBL. I said that in one breath. Jesus Christ. I'm not signing any of these old fucks. Because half of them are dead fucks. Nine free agents. Let's see. Mustafa Ali. Cameron Grimes. Who the fuck? Bordrick. And fucking Red Monsoon. Bobby McQueen. Alright, let's let's book a match, shall we? Let's do Bucky Murphy. Bucky. Buddy Murphy versus fucking Roman Reigns. Um, in an extreme rules match. Yeah. I don't even really have enough for an extreme rules match. Nah, it's the normal match. I can't be spending too much money. And we'll have, I don't know, let's have Kofi Kingston do a self promotion. Actually, nah. Let's have him do a charity promo. And 
let's do a tag team match between um, Liv Morgan, Rhea Ripley, Asuka, and Alexa Bliss. And then we'll have a call out promo. Uh, let's have Sami Zayn call out Edge. Seth Rollins versus uh, Edge. And let's have it be a tables match. Call though. the day let's see how it does and compared to to all the other to fucking my rival mediocre Come on, you guys gotta be doing better than mediocre and disappointing. See, why are the promos good? One, two, three. Okay, Edge. Now let's see how Rod did. No, oh, come on. Their opening was better than mine. Their promo was better than mine. One, two, three. One, two, three. Why you gotta do this to me? Edge has a really great feel for tables matches. SmackDown should take advantage. Asuka and Alexa Bliss worked out okay as a tag team, I guess. Sami Zayn calling out Edge tonight and hitting the target. Good promo. You talk a good game, but my fists are gonna do the talking next week. I like that. Every match in this week's SmackDown felt different from the last one. Kept me interested. Liv Morgan gets a win over Asuka, hashtag SmackDown. Put on a good performance against Roman Reigns, but sometimes the result just doesn't go your way. That Kofi Kingston promo was good for a cause. Was for a good cause, although it was kind of boring. I don't know how to feel about Oscar vs. Liv Morgan, so try to hear, to cheer for just one of them. What did you think, Murphy? I was just going to win today. I always, I'm always in control. Wait, how am I better in the ratings? Sami Zayn B Edge in an okay match. Then the promo was good. From AJ Styles, the promo was good. Alexa Bliss wins in a completely shit match. And here's the main event tag match. Roman Reigns and Seth Rollins win in a great match. Hey, I think my my show is probably gonna do better than your show. One, two, three. Apollo Cruz wins in an okay opener. One, two, three. 
Timothy Thatcher wins in a mediocre mid mid card match. And the main event, Roderick Strong versus Big E. Roderick Strong beats Big What? What? I don't make no goddamn sense. Bro, what are you talking about, man? I'm still on top. You wanna know why? Cause I'm I'm the beast. Badlands Chugs is the best. We're in Philadelphia. Making sure you're matching up superstars who pair well against each other. Other styles of fighting like Alexa really have been mismatched. Shut the fuck up, Triple H. I know what the fuck I'm doing, you're Remember that I don't I don't care. I don't I don't care. I know what I'm doing, Hunter. I know what I'm doing. And you know what, just to prove I know what I'm doing. I'm gonna put AJ Styles in a match with motherfucking Kofi Kingston in a tables match and have an interference by um, Seth Rollins. Seth Rollins is going to be fucking everybody's ass though. Styles in a mediocre match of a good promo. Love Morgan versus Oscar. Please, please don't be disappointing. Oh my God! Why? Kevin Owens in a in a okay heel promo. Now I actually want to spectate this match, so we're gonna do so. Let's see who's going to get the W. Is it going to be Edge? Or is it going to be Sami Zayn? Let's find out. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. And is for the WWE Universal Championship. Here comes Sami Zayn. I guess so. This means the conspiracy is continuing. They never stop with this guy. Now, yeah, Sami Zayn deserves this match after his banger with Johnny Knoxville at WrestleMania. Let's see if Zayn can get the job done. I'm not, I'm gonna guess no, cause he's facing Edge, but you know what, you never know. Look at this guy. Byron, here's a superstar who really is living his dream. This WWE Hall of Famer breathing truly rarefied. Let's see if Edge is going to retain his championship. Edge also had a good match at WrestleMania, but it wasn't it wasn't like Sami Zayn's match. That was just too great.
Introducing the challenger from Montreal, Quebec, Canada. Two Canadians fighting over a title belt. Introducing the champion from Toronto, Ontario, Canada, weighing in at 249 pounds. He is the WWE Universal Champion, the Rated R Superstar. What? What? You didn't do the thing. You motherfucker. You didn't do the thing. This is always a match with enormous implications for the landscape of the entire WWE. Be like the rated R Superstar. Hey. Not like how he fucking said it. Sami Zayn. Edge. Who's gonna get the dub? Mm. To worry about. The champ needs not worry about anything else than what's in front of him. He knows what a capable, dangerous competitor his challenger is. No Edge is putting the, the, the pieces on Sami Zayn right now. Play. It's just Nation. fucking him up. Uh, Zayn's fighting back. All Sami Zayn has to do is go after Edge's neck. Go after up. Oh, see, he caught him with a with a nice kick to the neck. Sami Zayn heard me. Damn, bro. I'm down. I'm going to the top rope. That was a shitty splash. I don't know what you guys are talking about. Oh, oh, oh. All edge with the reversal. He's moving out of the way. He's putting the hands on Sami Zayn right now, slapping him, chopping him. Executioner. Damn Edge, you're not giving him no chances. Edge really wants to retain up. Sami Zayn. Blue Thunder Bomb. Come on. What is the ref doing? Edge is kicking out. Edge is still in the match. Sami Zayn's not done with him, but Edge ain't done with the match just yet. He's trying to retain his title. There's his own signature. Impaler DDT sends him into the mat, plants him. What's this guy Edge doing? Going for the pin. And Sami Zayn kicks out. The crowd is going ape shit. Oh, what a rude super kick from Edge. Setting Sami Zayn up for the spear. Is he gonna land it? Damn, got his ass. Zane is out. He's done. One, two, three. I knew Edge was gonna win. I have faith in the people I put the championship on. God damn it. Oh my god, Badlands. How could you do this to me? God damn it. Right before the pay-per-view. Right before the... You're not going to like this, but none of us... But none of Oscar, Murphy, and Liv wanted to take part in your shows this week. Sorry about that. What? What? Are you fucking kidding me?
Hey Badlands Chug, just wanted to let you know that I plan on taking Rod to the top of the power rankings and staying there. Fuck you, you British bastard. Fuck you. And your strong style wrestling. I don't give a shit if you fucking... What you've done. I have the roster and the show running capabilities to do it. I don't think SmackDown stands a chance. You really think you can contend with us when we have superstars like Bailey? Get real. Shut the fuck. Bailey is the best thing you got. Look at who's my world champion, and I don't even know who your your world champion is. You're just salty because I took Roman Reigns before you can get to him. I don't care, Hunter, bro. Like I don't. Listen, I'm not feeling physically 100% tonight. I don't mind pain, but I don't want a serious injury. Sorry, Kofi. We have work to do. Sure, get some rest. You know what, Kofi? Sure, get your rest, bruh. Get your rest. Thanks, boss. I appreciate it. Edge cheated me in that last match. I want a rematch in the next two weeks. Bro, you're getting a no chance, Sami Zayn. You're getting a championship match the the fucking next week, not the next two weeks. You're retarded. No chance in hell. What? Why are you protecting Edge? I'm not protecting Edge, Zayn. You just don't know what I have in mind for you, you dumbass. So I can't use Murphy. Why did their fucking contracts expire or some shit? Murphy was literally just feuding with Roman Reigns. Okay, well, uh, let's do AJ Styles versus. To, uh, I need to sign some free agents. Okay, John Morrison is a heel. Pete Dunn. Trent Seven. Fuck it, let's go with Pete Dunn. Pete Dunn on the roster. AJ Styles versus, um, yeah, Pete Dunne. Kevin Owens and Sami Zayn versus Women's matches always fucking suck. Oof. What the fuck was the you people? 
Wow. Wow. Why, why, why I gotta be the beast? Overusing Biggie, you can fucking get injured soon. Not impressed, SmackDown. Next week needs to be better than this. Shut the fuck up. I have my faith in Badlands Chugs. SmackDown making a good pickup with Pete Dunne. I have to say, I'm liking Kevin Owens more as a bad guy than as a good guy. Edge trying to sell us stuff tonight, but at least it was a fairly entertaining program. Not much variety in this week's SmackDown. Time to mix it up a bit, like maybe throw in some tag matches. I'm sorry I didn't have enough fucking superstars for tag matches. Keep done as be satisfied he destroyed AJ Styles tonight. You ever pity a bad superstar like Seth Rollins and give them a free win? Even I can't be generous sometimes. I don't know how to feel about Owens versus Rollins. Couldn't tell who to get booed. Who got booed more? Had a good match and a close win against Rhea Ripley not letting up against not letting up though, gotta keep improving. Love seeing the growing rivalry with Alexa Bliss and Rhea Ripley. Get the spotlight on Raw. Hashtag, to fucking hashtag Smackdown. All right, we have one more show to do, and that's WrestleMania Backlash. Just a quick reminder, your fans want to see great matches. Yeah, yeah. The visionary has arrived. I've been putting in a lot of work. I think I've earned a shot at the title. Ha ha ha, how about it? You're right, Seth. You get your shot within three weeks. Great, looking forward to it. Ha 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 ha. Seems I'm not the only visionary here. Hey Badlands Chugs, you've seen the work I've been putting in. I know I can do more for the brand. I'm ready to run a main event match. I know the fans will be excited for it. This will mean a lot to me in my career, what do you say? Yeah. Alright. That's a big signing right there. Brock Lesnar? Yes, sir. Sami Zayn getting that other championship match.
I'm gonna have to do this. The concert hall. I'm gonna have to do what I have to do. It sucks, but you know what? It's gonna have to, what's gonna have to happen. Now let's, I'm gonna watch Roman Reigns versus Murphy and the other Sami Zayn versus Edge match. Let's see. Rhea Ripley retains the belt. Well, the disciple has arrived. One of the most dynamic athletes in WWE. Guy, Buddy Murphy. Weighing in at 213 pounds, Murphy. There he is, head of the table. And his opponent from Pensacola, Florida, weighing in at 265 pounds, Roman. Now I suspect Roman Reigns is gonna wipe well, some Murphy's may question the change in Roman's attitude. full face you off. Like he's just he gonna grab his hand, wipe it Jason all over Murphy's face, and it's gonna be gone. Oh, it's gonna be flesh and bone by the time no Roman Reigns is done with Murphy. But I could just be underestimating competitors in WWE history. Oh, he'll show why you know what? Let's find out. Chain. Here's Roman Reigns, who has declared himself the tribal chief of WWE. Yeah, Reigns thinks only he has the strength and wisdom to be the face of his industry. Well, we'll see if Reigns is able to take that command in this matchup. Then there's Murphy and fighting the ring. Man searching for recognition. A superstar who's trying to step out of the shadows and make a name for himself. Murphy may be overshadowed at times, but make no mistake about it. Murphy's a wildly talented competitor with a chip on his shoulder and fire in his lung. Went for that. It's kind of missed. Damn, kicked him right in the back of the head. Murphy going for the power bomb. Right to the ankle. Reigns had that scouted. Beautiful suplex. Reigns is taking back the control. Punch him right now. Just rapid fire punches. More punches to the head. Murphy turned it around. Now he elbows and forearms to the face. Roman Reigns. Ooh. Caught him. More punches to the head. God, we got his shoulder. Murphy gonna tap. Yo. Reigns to the outside. Flinging Reigns outside. What's Murphy looking to do? No outs, no worries. More power bombs on the outside. Boom. Stomping on his ankles again. Again? Murphy wants to absolutely dominate Roman Reigns. Super kick to the face, that ought to do it. Face right into the ring post. 
He was getting a huge boost right now from all those chants and cheers. Right to the throat. Man oh, man, he's just fighting back. Murphy just lost all the control he just made. Oh, look at this. Ooh, cleaned his clock with that clothesline. Superman punch went for it and missed. Murphy's fighting back. He's going for it. Murphy's law. He got it. Did he? Oh, nah, Roman kicked out. The big dog will not quit. And Murphy got all of that last move, too. Ooh, ooh, combos. Knee to the face. Murphy's moving, but Reigns beats it. Roman Reigns put power bombs of his own. Murphy's still got a finisher to go. Reigns comes up short. There we go, and Murphy be able to get the win on pay-per-view. Doesn't look like it. It looks like Roman Reigns might take this one. Roman Reigns has the spear ready. He's just got to use it at any moment in time. Another clock cleaning clothesline. Kicking Murphy in his back. Ooh, right to the face. Yeah, I think Roman Reigns is, is oh, school boy, school boy. Almost got him. Roman Reigns sending Murphy to the outside now. He's taking this to the floor now. Reigns has two finish. What is he gonna do with? He could he can end Murphy's career right now. He's got it in the guillotine. Murphy's gonna tap. Murphy's gonna tap. Murphy's gonna tap. Yep, Murphy lost. Roman wins. Murphy. He put up a fight, but of course the tribal chief is gonna fucking beat Roman. Pete Dunn and AJ Styles. Medium. God damn. One, two, three. Sami Zayn wins the title in an amazing match. I'm just gonna simulate. Raw went over me again. Seth Rollins attacked Edge during the match. Things about to get worse. Sami Zayn has a really great fuel for TLC matches. SmackDown should take this advantage. I liked Raw and SmackDown equally last month, but SmackDown has dropped off off the pace. Put some put on some better matches. He, you. Legend Machine 2, how about you go fuck yourself?